solve this equation, n is a positive integer to 1, 3, 3, 1 in base 4 equals 1, 6, 0, 0 in base n. 1 in base 4 here means 1 times 4 to the power of 0. 3 in base 4 here means 3 times 4 to the power of 1. Similarly, the other digits in this equation can also be written in this way. So the left-hand side of the equation is equal to 2 times 4 to the power of 4 plus 1 times 4 cubed plus 3 times 4 squared plus 3 times 4 to the power of 1 plus 1 times 4 to the power of 0. And the right hand side of the equation is equal to 1 times n cubed plus 6 times n squared plus 0 times n to the power of 1 plus 0 times n to the power of 0 or to the power of 0 is 1. 1 times 1 is 1. 3 times 4 to the power of 1 is 3 times 4, which is 12. 3 times 4 squared is 3 times 16, which is 48. 4 cubed is 64. 1 times 64 is 64. What's the power of 4 is 256. 2 times 256 is 500. And 12. 0 times anything is 0. 6 times n squared is 6 n squared. 1 times n cubed is n cubed. 48 plus 12 is 60. 1 plus 64 is 65. 65 plus 60 is a hundred and twenty-five. Five hundred and twelve plus one hundred and twenty-five is six hundred and thirty-seven. So by rearranging the equation, we can now write n cubed plus six n squared minus six hundred and thirty-seven equals zero minus six hundred and thirty-seven can be written as minus three hundred and forty-three and minus two hundred and ninety-four three hundred and forty-three can be written as 7 cubed, 6 and squared, and 294 have a common factor, 6. So we can now write 6 times n squared minus 49. A cubed minus b cubed can be written as a minus b times a squared plus AB plus B squared. By applying this, N cubed minus 7 cubed can be written as N minus 7 times N squared plus 
plus 7n plus 7 squared a squared minus b squared can be written as a plus b times a minus b. By applying this, n squared minus 49 can be written as n minus 7 times n plus 7. We can see that the two terms have a common factor, n minus 7. So the left hand side of the equation can now be written as n minus 7 times n squared plus 13n plus 91. Case 1, n minus 7 equals 0. So n equals 7. Case 2, n squared plus 13n plus 91 equals 0. The discriminant is equal to 13 squared minus 4 times 91. The discriminant must be less than 0, which means there are no real solutions. We're given that n is a positive integer, so this case is discarded. Now we have an additional problem. Find k to 0 to 3 in base 10 equals 1, 4, 2 in base k, where k is a positive integer.